hey everybody it's saturday january 20th 2024 it's getting down to 25 degrees tonight we've had a week of really cool weather or cold weather for us and out here at the citrus garden one of the things that we've had to do last year when it got down to 18 degrees three nights in a row around christmas um, we lost several of our citrus trees so emily found these little greenhouses on Amazon. I think they're like 16 bucks, which isn't bad when you consider a blanket for your trees is around 10 or $11. They're pretty simple, like an erector set or a little tent, um, but came with a real nice little vinyl thing. And then we took hurricane lanterns and we're using paraffin oil, which is one of the cleaner burning oils. Not that I'm crazy about it or know that that's the best idea. But versus running electricity out here and putting light bulbs, we just ran around to Walmart and got all these little hurricane lanterns. And uh, they've been doing a great job of keeping it warm in there. And then first thing in the morning, once the sun comes up, we obviously turn out the lanterns. It's nice and warm in there still, even though it's getting down to 25, 26 degrees tonight. But these have done great. Not really sure how the paraffin oil and the fumes go with the plants, but I don't know, it's either that or they have a hard freeze and we lose them. So this was the best thing I could come up with. I don't know if it's the best idea. You guys can comment below, but with the weather the way it's been, we've done a lot of inside projects. One of the other things that we've been doing is working on these display stands for granny cats. So let's go in and check that out. Back up here at the barn got all the staining done this week so that was a good thing to finish up even though it was a little cold to be staining but got all that done we've had a couple really nice campfires we got more steel from Rudy to build three more of the firewood racks that we need over there because we got plenty of firewood that we still need to get split with our new splitter Got the water shut off out here to the shower and to the uh, clawfoot tub because, it, again, it's going to have a hard freeze tonight. But this is what we've been working on. So what we've been working on in here is these display racks for Granny Cat's apiary and bee supply. Been welding these things up, not really too hard. Um, cutting them, I think, is the harder part, just because you got to notch out the steel. So they put these notches in them. That way, when you do the corners, they weld up. So I'm doing the cutting. Emily's doing the welding, and then it really takes both of us to make sure that everything's tacked up, level, and. Uh, evenly spaced but dealing with metal everything I, I mean we're not professionals at this obviously but everything always seems to be like an eighth of an inch off or, which isn't bad but it, there's no perfection to doing this or at least not at our level but they look pretty good but this kept us busy since it's been nice and cold outside um, but again Got to get this done so we can get this area cleaned up and cleared so I can get two by fours delivered here to start getting them up there to start doing Emily's office, which should be the end of this week or first of next week. So that's what we've been doing out here at Deer Run Farm. <laughs> 